やセカンド What is up guys? Welcome back to another live reaction of Nanatsu no Taizai. This is episode 19. Last episode we had Eskinor's past and he is still fighting the Demon King and also we got to see Melidas vs. Eskinor before the 10 year time skip. So at this point it's 1-1. Okay, Melidas won one, Eskinor won one. So it's going to be interesting to see how this battle is going to go. I mean, the Demon King is fighting Eskinor. Melidas won against Eskinor. Let's see how this is going to go. Let's go and see. Um, episode 19, as always, if you guys are new, do subscribe. There is a channel update out to let you guys know what else is happening on this channel. So do check it out. It's in our channel, obviously. Um, let's go and get this going, people. Episode 19. I am a manga reader, guys. Just. Okay, look at him. He's literally on fire. Even the demon king is shocked. At this point, only he can do is watch. You know, I was wondering when I was reading the manga, uh, when this started, like Eskinor using his basically life energy as a magic at this point. Was there a need for this to happen? Because at this point, they only need to protect Gilda, everybody else is back. But then I was thinking, if, if he is going to die, as he was saying, he don't have much time. Um, if he is going to die, Will I be satisfied with him dying on a bed as an old man or rather not really old man anymore? Um, he can't. I don't think he will have time to grow old. Probably, let's say a year or so. Will you be happy to see him in his weak state for a year or will you be uh, happy to see him fighting? Don't know the result yet. Maybe taking down the Demon King along the route. The struggle 
Okay, interesting title. Dude, the wound instantly healed. Okay, obviously they're predicting Escano result. They don't have a moment to spare. Okay, what is this now? Creepy. When there's a hand coming out of a mouth, creepy. Oh boy. Dude, it's all combined together against whatever that creature is. Dude, instant defeat to whatever that is. Even the Demon King wasn't expecting
man with pride asking for forgiveness. When you see Eskador speaking like this, it hurts. It really hurts. Especially in his prideful. Okay, what is this now? Wow, Demon King is so desperate now. <laughs> you would hit your dad. Yeah, that's not going to happen. What's the difference between taking over his body and killing him? I mean, exactly. <laughs> As I said, he is desperate. But he is not fighting. And also, he's not fighting alone. <laughs> he had to make sure. Do you know what's going on outside? Obviously he's lying again and again. Apparently that seems normal. Normal to Demon King. Oh. 
Oh man, if you haven't seen the movie trailer, you must. Now he's trying to emotionally appeal. Oh boy. It's almost like he hockeyed up. Inside and outside. Uh-oh. It seems like that's complete. Bad? <laughs> You took the first step toward manhood. <laughs> I was about to say like nobody paying attention to him <laughs> look at Eskino just cash it is like whoa okay he's splitting up oh boy the land itself is changing. That's how desperate he is, people. It's funny, it's very windy outside. It's hard to fit the scenario. Dude, look at the amount of like set of teeth he have. Okay, that's greedy.
Oh. <laughs> oh. Well, we'll find out. I feel sorry for Hauser, man. The, pe the people in fear. All right. Okay, I have to say the last moment is pretty cool, okay? Um, but yeah, Demon King is... The one word I can describe this episode is desperate. Um, this is the third rematch, right? Well, technically fourth rematch. First one within uh, Purgatory. Second one is in Melirasa's body. Third one is in Zelris's body. Now the fourth one is... He's taking over the land. He fought himself, couldn't win. He fought in uh, Melirasa's body, couldn't win. He fought in Zelris' body, he couldn't win. Now he's fighting as the land. So looking forward to seeing how this is going to go. Um, that was a bit emotional at the start with uh, when it's come to Eskanor. He's still burning. He's still in his the one form. That means he's still burning his life energy. I wish he would stop. I mean, I think the other six should be able to take care of him. But it seems like he also want to fight. He did ask, please let me fight with you. You know, when a pride Eskanor asks you that, when he say please to something, I don't think you can refuse. So that's what's happening there. Um, Hawk and Mama Hawk, they both were on their way here. But then, yeah, it just seems like Hawk had a change of plan as soon as he saw what's there. Uh, Feeling sorry for Hauser. Love to know your thoughts, people. All right, let's see the preview. Diana and Elizabeth. Okay. <laughs> mortal enemies okay um by the way that creature i don't remember that seeing in the manga i think it's because it's had a like less green type and when they put this in the opening song right i was a bit confused nobody seems to remember when this beast that one with the mask uh showed up it's it's almost like a page out of bleach all of a sudden came in but yeah uh it was it was just random i i, I don't remember that now that i said it bleach i think i think i said this in the manga uh reaction that reference to a bleach but anyway so 
yeah looking forward to this hopefully the final match of this battle but yeah demon king is desperate i can't wait to see what's going to happen and also what's going to happen afterward um a lot to look forward to we have five more episodes so a lot of a lot of content to cover as well so yeah looking forward to it let me know your thoughts your reaction in the comment section that's pretty much it from me thank you so much for watching with me if you enjoyed the reaction don't forget to leave a thumbs up stay safe people have a wonderful day of night and see you guys with more videos